Okay, so today we're going to go through how to backup all of our original old DVD to uh, MP4. This is for Big Sur, so it's a little bit different due to all of these um, security stuff. So first we need to install Homebrew. So go to uh, brew.sh and then we're going to copy this one and we open the terminal and then we just paste the and then make sure we have internet so it depends on how fast your internet is it's gonna download and install the Xcode so download the Xcode uh, command line it may take a while lib dvd css okay so lib dvd css 1.4.2 so it's already installed so when you install this already this is important right here you can open handbrake so i got download handbrake and right now it's download handbrake 133 right so when we open the handbrake, the DVD drive with the DVD in it, open. Live DVD CSS is actually the driver to unprotect the content. So you make sure that it's saved as MP4, so how to set this up. So you have the handbrake preferences, default MP4 extension. Don't, they they default to auto and then they're gonna go to .m4v but we want to force them to mp4 advanced so I think they default automatically so DVD reader use so it's already ticked for you already so make sure you have this what I do is I always the default at 1080 we're gonna go to video the dimension on this one they crop it for you because it's 720 by 480 and filter we don't put anything default video so it depends on how good the quality is you want to do you can do to go to the right 20 is, is the best actually they, they did 22 is already good I think the quality is good already because it is a DVD. The frame rate, we always want the same as source, whatever it is, okay? Audio, English, 5.1 channel, right? Subtitle, now. You open this up, so you see English widescreen. So we choose this one okay we don't f we don't force no burning we just hit default so now we will have the mp4 with the subtitle just in case we need to turn it on depends on the um, depends on the player on your computer chapter is already there so let's hit start now we're going to change this one to a sd1 since i already did one so it depends on how fast your computer it will take a few minutes this is a very fast computer so you see it's 270 frames per second that is very fast this is i7 6900k and this is Pixar. When it's done, we go to movies and we will see the file MP4. So, quick time we open with VLC. We want to see the um, so we want to see the subtitle and we click the subtitle here. And it 
should come up. So it's done.